Hey caregivers, I wanted to say hi and just give you a quick idea of what's going on with this whole stuck at home Bible camp thing. My name is Krista Paradiso. I'm an elder in the United Methodist Church. Basically, I'm a pastor serving two smaller churches in Chicago, Illinois. I am also mom of two kids and auntie by either blood or bond to about a bazillion others. I am familiar with that fear and that dread that can creep in when we think about what happens if we get sick or our kiddo gets sick and also what am I going to do with them for seven days a week if I can't have play dates? I can't make them lunch for you. I can't come over and fold your laundry and just talk for a while. I wish we could do that. But staying away for each other for the good of all means we have to find new ways of being together. And I hope that's where the church and the internet can come in. I really believe that the church should be the most flexible, creative, and adaptable group of humans on the planet. If we love a God who is like, well, this isn't working, and became flesh, why would we let mere logic or practicality tell us what's possible? Now, if you know church, you know that's not always the case. But we're trying to bring a little bit of that sparkle, that shine, that possibility into this unknown time. So Stuck at Home Bible Camp is offering you a short break that we hope you can trust. In somewhere between 15 to 30 minutes, your kiddo will hear a story, do an activity or two that doesn't require a lot of supplies or mess, and be with, in some ways, an adult who isn't going to talk about the COVID-19 virus, who is not going to talk about how, and who is not going to try to convert you or your child or anyone in your family to a particular sort of Christianity. We're here to try to share some of God's love, some of that comfort and hope and joy in interactive ways. I also promise there will be no unboxing and no playing with toys because I don't know about you, but I don't need any more of those right now. You can find us on Facebook if you look for the Stuck at Home Bible Camp Facebook page. We'll also be sharing resources and other things that are helping us get through this together, even when together is far apart. Know that we're praying for you, we're sending you strength and love and hope, and get in touch and tell us what else would be helpful for you. Peace.